When I was at Covenant Church, uh, it was a wonderful experience to be a part of that. And somehow or other, I always saw us as all the same. That is, there's the preacher and all that, and there's all the parishioners. That's not true. Those people have as much to say at times than I did. It was always a good experience. And I always look for things like that. I look for people to come up to somebody and talk with them and say, what happened over there? And, and what happened over there? And how do you feel now? And what's going on next week? And all that. That's the church. But in the process of this, something happened one day which amazed me, and I can't wait to tell you. The service was over. Our service had chairs around the, up to the front, and people could sit at wherever they wanted to. And as the service was coming to a close, and the last piece of music was going to occur, right in the front row, there was a young lady who looked like she was crying, but she was also laughing. I looked at her, and I thought, she must have heard a joke somewhere. And so when the place ended, and we were ready to go home, I walked out to see her because I thought, are you okay, is what I wanted to say. Are you okay? Did something go wrong? I walked down and I looked at her and I said, uh, hello. And I had never seen her before. And I said, are you okay? And she said, oh, yes, I'm okay. And I said, well, um, were you laughing over some reason? She said, yes, I was. What was that? She said, I just came to this area from some time away and I didn't feel at home. I miss my mother, my father, my family, everybody. And I came here and I, I work for the Board of Education. I, I teach music to children. And uh, I don't know what to do. I'm, I'm having a hard time. I said, and she said, but today was good. She said, it made me feel like I was at home. And I said, well, what I was trying to say, she said, oh, nothing, which, nothing that you had to say. <laughs> and I laughed. I couldn't stop laughing. The average minister might say, who do you think you are? <laughs> she was wonderful. She was telling me one thing that I didn't know, and that is, I was lost and now I'm found. I have a place to be, and she stayed there for quite a while. What a wonderful person, and the way she said it. And if some minister would ever say, you said something about my sermon being bad, and I would say, I think it was hilarious. She was a nice lady. We all were at some point or time.